Right, before I get into this video, I just want to explain where the ever-loving frog I've been. I've had so much stuff to do this week. I've had exams, original flag exams, work experience, and I found a new hobby, making rings. And the gun I was going to show you broke in two pieces. So here's the gun I was going to show you. It's the Farquhar Hill, Britain's first semi-automatic rifle. And as you can see, <laughs> it's clearly broke. And I think you can guess how it broke. It fell. But I don't want this just to be an apology video, so... I'm going to show you one of the first warning guns I made, the MP40. Like the MG42, I actually made this for my dad for Christmas, but unlike the MG42, I managed to complete it before Christmas Day. And like the MG42, it only has around two moving parts. It has a movable magazine, and probably the worst bolt you'll ever see in your life. I mean, just, just look at this. It actually moves just fine, it's pretty smooth, but it gets stuck about halfway through, and you can even take it out. What was I playing at? I actually might drop this thing, jeez. The stock doesn't move, it's stationary because there's kind of no way I could have made it lock when it's out, so I just glued it in. I like all my original wooden guns, if I was making this today, it would be a way better. In fact, maybe, I might make it again, and show you how to make it. Or not, I don't know. Can't really be bothered sometimes. But like I said, if I was making it now, it would be like, whew, it would be really good. Basically, all the gun is made from the stuff that I usually use, the, uh, the LDF wood, you know, the stuff that shelves are made from nowadays, and the barrel is made from, I think, a just a curtain pole that I scrapped. I think this is probably one of the favourite guns I made because, well, first of all, it was one of the first ones, and it's really detailed for the time when I made it. I've gotten almost every detail right from down to the screws, down to all the bevels on the plates. So that's what you all can say about it. There's like the MG42 where it has all these big pieces but I have to explain how I did it. It was actually pretty simple. So yeah, as always, unsubscribe, smash that dislike button and see you later. So...